Hey everybody, this is Dave Cooper and we are live at Advancing Prefab and standing with me is Jamie Johnson from Bryden Woods. Jamie, how's it going? Very good, thanks. Awesome to be here in uh, yeah. Phoenix and thanks for the invite to come on the show. Yeah, well one, it's nice weather and two, Hey, Amy Marks is in. Oh, what are you doing, Dave? Amy, come on in the this center here. This is my show. We're, we're going to do a Dave Cooper this is, live this takeover is our show. show with the queen of prefab, Amy Marks. This is advancing prefab, Dave. You can, I'll still let you stay and hold the camera. How about that? I, I saw my name on the banner. I thought I could come in. No, this is advancing prefab. So I'm glad you're all joining us live for the queen of prefab takeover show of the Dave Cooper live show. Let's go meet some of the amazing people Let's at advancing prefab and Jamie. Yes. Thanks for being here too. No trouble. <laughs> right, here we go. All right, listen, we're going to go live right now on a mobile camera. So we're going to turn one on and we're going to turn one off and we should have some fun. mobile camera. So we're going to turn one on and we're going to turn one off and we should have some fun. There we are. All right, let's go, Amy. Here we let's go. Let's go, Jamie. All right, Dave, you just get to hold the talk camera. It, it. You get to oh. hold the camera, Dave. You don't have to do much. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. I'm going to give you a vacation from the Dave Cooper live show. Well, all right. So, so look, we do this cool thing every year. It's speed dating. It's like speed networking. That's actually where I first met Christian Garnett, by the okay. way. Yeah. And so wait, here's some of my friends that I can introduce you to. Great, hey, great. Guys. Come on in there, Jamie. Speed networking. So, um, Wesley Baker from TD Industries. We got Randy Heron. I know her really well. We did a really cool tour of their shop in episode four. You should watch that. Yep. Really cool. And Jeff Eggleston, you've been here every year. Yep, every year. Schneider Electric. How's the show been for you guys? Tell us what the show means for you guys. Like, I think it's fantastic to hear new ideas, uh, where the future of construction is going, and um, how we can participate in what we need to be doing now to get there. You've been here every year, right? It's been great. I, I, I love the networking. I love to see it growing. I love the new ideas. Uh, it's, it's fun listening to different perspectives. And being a manufacturer, we want to support these people. This is how we learn to improve what we're doing. I love that. Yeah. Big companies, great companies all over here. Brian Dilly, come here. I know you. Hey. Brian was here. And how are you doing, Aaron? These guys are presenting this year at Lake Erie. And um, tell me, can we talk about the cool story that happened? Yeah, man, that's great. Tell us all about it. So uh, essentially, we came to this conference two years ago. Uh, it was my first time here. Um, you know, we're, we're breaking into this space a little bit more. And uh, one, I feel very overwhelmed my first year here. Uh, like, it, it, was, it was a lot. I believe his exact words are when he came back is, we're not going to make it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But, you know, Amy was kind of like my lifeline. Uh, she, she said, you know, if you can take away one thing from this conference, bring it home and implement it, it'll be a success. We did that, I'd like to say, and that's what our case study is about. And uh, it really shined, I think. It was a great thing. Um, we look forward to taking more away this year. And, Bring it home again. I just love that you took the one thing away, and they have this really amazing, successful project, and they're doing it as a really nice tribute to one of their team members that passed away during COVID. And I think it just was so heartfelt for me when you wrote the letter to me, and I wanted to make sure you guys read the show. And, and they're doing great work over there. These are the guys that are figuring out the really complicated stuff, right? Yeah. These guys. By the way, you're much taller and not on Zoom. I like, know. <laughs> I slouch. <laughs> so Lake Erie, are you in Pennsylvania, Lake Erie? No, no. Ohio. Ohio? Yeah. Okay. All throughout Ohio and Michigan, Southeast Michigan. Yeah, yeah. What do you think of the show so far? It's awesome, huh? Yeah. Oh, this is great. I had so much knowledge taken. I love it. You know, and I finally got other people listening to me and getting the, trying to get on to the right. same level as everyone here. It's great. I mean, there's just so much to learn. and It makes you feel not alone. <laughs> you're <laughs> so, never alone. I'm, a, like, you know, I'm always here. You're never alone. Good. Thank you, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, I see who's behind them. So come over here. Let's go here. Hey, Steph Jeffers. I'm going to put you on camera. The woman doesn't want to be on camera. Autodesk Construction Cloud. I'm yeah. from Autodesk, obviously, while we see them in the background. Oh, you can't escape camera. Ah, look, he's running. Get over look, here, my the, the camera always follows beards. I know, beards. these Autodesk guys always are all so shy. Beards. So, no, we, I have been doing this show for six years, and I was really lucky two years ago when I came over that Autodesk decided to sponsor and get behind the show. And Autodesk Construction Cloud has a great booth here. We did some great sponsorship of the tours, and we do a great party every year. So I just want to thank Sarah Rolfing and you guys, Steph Jeffers. They don't want to be on camera. They're the most amazing marketing team out there helping us in field marketing. So thank you guys for coming out yeah. to all these shows. Hey, and thanks for letting us be here with you guys. Yes, we love having you guys it's, here. It's the Amy Cooper Show. Hey! <laughs> How are you? What's going on, oh, Dave? Man. I love 
part. This is my favorite part of speed networking. So, Dato, amazing. Hey, Dato, nice to meet you. And also sponsors and exhibitors here. That's right. Tell us. Go ahead and you're... get in there, Jamie, with them, please. Come on, Jamie. I need you to be my. I need you to be my good-looking sidekick. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, so Dato is an intelligent, intelligent search platform for construction documents. Uh, okay. We work with trade contractors to help automate document workflows. So great. Uh, in the prefabrication space, which we're all talking about here, lots of shop drawings, school drawings, school application drawings, all those get automated in Dato. Uh, makes life easy. We love our partnership with Autodesk. We have a direct integration with uh, Construction Cloud. So we love that. So far, so good. Yeah. And by the way, I remember when you guys were here last year. And where's Travis? Yeah, he is. Uh, Double booked. Oh, That's double right. booking yeah. right now. Double okay, booked. That's okay. By the way, you always know you've had a good show when there are also multiple parties, multiple things. These guys throw a great party. Make sure <laughs> in any show you go to the Dato party. It's a lot, a lot of fun. Okay, I'm in. I see other people we know. Let's nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Give me yeah. a hug. Thanks for coming and supporting. Yep. You guys, super awesome. Hey! hey what's up? What's going on? Mike Lawson, Civic Fence. I love it. Uh, By the way, you guys, I was talking about you guys the other day. You were one of my first. Six figure contracts when I own my own company that I got from digital and social media years and years ago. And I'm still taking up all your stuff. I love it. I they still look at yeah. the stuff we did for consulting. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Jamie, get in here. I get you just have Hi, to Jamie. look pretty, Jamie. Come on, come here. You're usually the most intelligent person at the table, but I just need you to look But he has a great him. accent, too. And he has a good accent, right? So, Clark Pacific, their precast company in California, they, they do the most amazing stuff. They work on Apple headquarters, they do really heavy MVP integrated precast. Tell us why you come to the show. Well, because we keep expanding. So, we're working on actually building now total building systems. So, moving beyond precast to volumetric to wall panels, etc. So. And they have an amazing facility. Absolutely amazing. Lots of big space. And they're smart guys doing really, and women doing really smart things. So it's like meeting all, for me this is like old friends week, old, the old home week. So really appreciate everything you guys are doing. I'm looking forward to your next four jobs, like all the good four jobs that are coming out. Nice to meet you, Greg. Thank you, Thank Greg. You. Oh, that's Dave Cooper Live. We took over his show. Yeah, it's, it's really, I, I usually ask the questions, but not here. <laughs> this is actually Dave's show, but you know. I like this part. No pressure behind the camera. Big serial owners here. This is Dave uh, Dillon from Walgreens. Nice to meet you, Dave. I right. gave him a hard time up on stage. You know, all my big serial owners, they gotta they gotta push us, they gotta drive us. Hey Dave from yep. this Dave Sussman is conspectus. They have unbelievable building decision analysis, specification writing. They do great yeah. stuff over here. Also one of our partners at Autodesk, right? Awesome. Yes. And hopefully doing more forge ups. So my great. serial owners. That I was a little tough on you guys, wasn't I? A little bit? No, on you stage? Yeah, I think you I did. Oh, you took it easy on stage yesterday. I, I, I watched that. that now I'm on stage. Jamie, yeah, I gotta yeah. get tougher on these guys. I gotta get <laughs> yeah, yeah. So we have a lot of big owners here. I think that was that's one of the best parts about this show is that it's not a bunch of like sort of little modular guys talking about modular amongst themselves. It's amazing world class architects like Jamie. That's your part. You come up. You're the world class architect. You is a world class we, architect. And like guys like you know Gensler and Agent, all these guys. Front so we get world class architects. We get so big we owners like Walgreens. Yeah. Tell us on your journey. You know, you're on this journey for you know industrial construction. How has the show been for you? Feel free to say good and bad. I love improvements all the time. Yeah. But um, it's it's been really good. Um, there's certainly things I'd still like to see more of. Tell me, tell me. What do you want to see more of? I'd like to see more of my people here. Actually. I gotta get more owners. Uh, hey, because I, I, I agree. I'd love to see more. Yeah, I'd love to see more owners here, to be honest. Um, yeah. I'm actually surprised there's not more Emmy. I thought there really? would be a lot more of it. Yeah. I think well, we're, I think we're a th over a thousand people. I want to say I think we're fifty percent MVP subcontractors this year. Yeah, they're well, attendees, but I'm not sure about it. I think we want yeah. to see more MEP. All right. I want to, I'm looking for more solutions. MEP subcontractors be. get a booth next year. They want to see you at the booths. That's, That's right. right. It. And we'll always take more serial owners and big owners. And well, and, and so owners for multi circuit too. That's the thing oh, multi-site retail owners. I was well, say. that's that because that's what I don't see. I mean, yes. Even on our panel, Amy, yeah, I felt like the outlier because we did a lot of talking about data centers and much different yes. project scales. Yes, and those solutions don't necessarily. That's true. We know those guys. Did, so. We know those guys. They do multi-site um, banks. Those are the guys that are doing um, quick service there's restaurants. A lot, there's a lot of good those are the guys doing like you know healthcare, like you and all. The, they're out there. And by the way, most of them I've worked with in the past are all doing prefabrication. So we want to see them here. We'll get more of those. Dave Dillon wants to see you here. Yeah. So we got to get you guys. Out. Yeah. Well, He's we need lonely. another David because I'm a David too. Perfect. Well, by the way, this is the Dave Cooper Takeover Show. If you didn't recognize Dave, 
Today yeah, yeah. it's the Queen of Prefab Takeover show of the Dave Cooper Live show. So yeah, but I'm still you. here. Well, we're <laughs> we're letting him hold the camera, like yeah. Hey, and back there's where Amy's going to be on stage again. That's the small stage for a little sit-down coffee chat, right? Yes, I don't normally do a lot of Q and A at the show and stuff, yeah. so they asked me this year, would you right. would you just sit down for a little bit and not run around all the time and like let us ask you some questions? Right. So we have these cool couches, this really right. cool space, and um, I may I don't know I don't like to be there alone. Maybe you'll come with me. Jamie okay. should go up there. I got to see what he's going to say. I'll be speaking with Jamie in June at the uh, New Zealand House Embassy oh, in yes, England. Oh, that's right. Yeah, so we'll be over I there. I love it. By the way, I'm a rugby player, you know, for 15 years. But all black fern, all blacks. I'm all about the black ferns, though. Obsessive about the women's team in New Zealand. So I might have to come just to be a super fan of you both at the New Zealand Embassy in the UK. So good. Yeah, so if you would help me up there. Oh, come on, man. Yeah. Will you? Okay, I don't like to be, I'm very shy. I don't want to be up there. Joel Hutchins, so. I thought he was coming. He's in the audience. Hey, so. Joel Hutchins. <laughs> yeah, I love the audience out there. So thank you, guys. Okay. That's awesome. So let's walk around. We'll come to some other places. Come on. Hold that camera steady, Dave Cooper. Hey, I got stabilization. We're on the road. We're on the road with the Dave Cooper Look, they're running. Show. They're running. They're hiding. Hey. They're hiding. Hey, Mark. Mark Baicelli. Hey, so Mark. These guys are. Do you know them? I don't know. Oh my if God, I know. they're unbelievable. RK Industries. RK Industries. Okay, they nice to meet you. Most, do you guys know RK Industries? I don't know the name. So this no. Jamie Johnson. He's, he's, he's my he's my serious taller, better accent and sidekick today. We're doing the Dave Cooper live show. This is not Dave Cooper though. No. Nope. The Queen of Prefab. I'm I'm <laughs> here. I'm, I'm, I promise. <laughs> We're making you hold the camera. <laughs> And Mark has an amazing company called RK Industries. And tell us what RK does. So RK Industries does construction, manufacturing, fabrication, and service. Um, we build modular products, um, everything across the board from traditional construction. Talk to up, modular. talk up. I yeah, want to hear that. Traditional construction to modular products. And we're basically working all over the country and all over the world to uh, yeah. work with key people like Amy and other people here. We're loving the show. This is our first year here. Uh, everything's going great. Thank you to you. No, you no, I'm happy you're and, here. Um, I was able to speak on Monday, and we had a really good conference on Monday talking about different items. Good. Yeah, we're yeah. super excited. Uh, RK will be back again next year and um, right. excited to be here. We want everybody to get work from this show. Look, I always ask people, I'm like, to meet three great people and take one thing away from the conference. Have you met three people? Ten. Okay, good. Ten I'm great people. Ten. You're I'm taking not, ten with it? For, I'm going with the ten. Well, that's yeah, yeah. good. All right, let's go on the road. Let's see some more people. Right, let's go. Good. Nice, awesome. nice to meet you. Nice okay, to meet you. Look at the Here donuts. Uh, hold on. We're in with the <laughs> intelligentsia. Clark, how you been, man? I'll catch up with you in a little oh, bit. Oh, my friend's in Old friends, hey, how's it going? Good to see you. Hey, some of my building product manufacturer friends, they're turning into solution aggregators. Tell us about what you guys are doing now, because Hilti's doing great stuff. You have to talk up. This is the Dave Cooper live show. We're live right Hi, I'm Dave Cooper. But that's Dave Cooper. <laughs> I used to have a show. I'm pretending I'm Dave Cooper. I keep bringing my beautiful sidekick in. Jamie, Jamie. Jamie. world-class architect. Jamie Bryan, yeah. He's amazing, right? So yeah, you guys got to speak up, though, so I yeah, stay back. Yeah, talk about. Tell us what's it's going on here. It's about being a solutions partner, uh, bringing us in early, as we said early yesterday, but conceptually designing, building that for us early on with uh, focusing on applications where we know we can focus and win together. Uh, bringing everyone to the table at one uh, platform, whether it's a rag or uh, multi-trade solutions for overhead supports in a bar room, but rather than Handing someone some metal and say, hey, good luck. We're here to support you along the way. It's let's partner together, let's hold our sleeves together, let's figure out solutions together uh, in, a, in the virtual environment and the built environment uh, together. I mean, that's really it. And uh, of course, our hardware is innovative. We have innovation down to the task and to the person. But we're looking at the process as a whole. How do we build differently? Yes. With labor shortages, supply chain issues, the cards are really stacked against us. But you're getting bigger and bigger yes. aggregated assemblies. And by the way, I did my very first rack with Bill Caparito back in the day. Yes. I think it was 2008. We did 40 simulation of distribution racks. I think it were the first racks Hilti ever did with us. And we're scaling. We're taking that uh, globally. We're taking yeah. That globally. I love that. So big stuff happening at Hilti. Look out for you guys. Good. Let's keep going this way. Yeah, let's do it. One of my favorite, favorite people in the in the industry, literally. If you don't know about Durapods, these guys are from Philly, so you got to talk like you're from Philly. I'm from Jersey. He's from Philly. That's why we like each other. Tell us what Durapods is doing. Craig is 
amazing, by the way. One of my favorite people. Super nice. You want to work with nice people that do solutions. So tell us about Zero Bunny. Thank you. So we're a specialty carpentry contractor uh, located in Philadelphia. And through, uh, organically, over the last four years, we've been asked to create off-site manufacturing facilities and uh, do prefabricated bathrooms on some of our uh, integrated project delivery projects. We were on his first job together. Yes, yeah. and he got fired, actually. For... I did get fired for speaking out. I yes. did remember that? Yes. And so then afterwards, we met up again, and he was like, thank God you were on that, right? Yes. And I don't want to say, but one of your guys actually cried for yes, me. Yes, absolutely. So, but, but, but... <laughs> With that, gave us the opportunity to step in, and we've turned that into a business. So now Durapods does prefabricated bathrooms, prefabricated kitchens. We're doing modular gang bathrooms, uh, exterior wall panels. With don't say it can't them. happen in Philly, by the way. I don't okay. want to ever hear that again. I don't want to hear about the waterless urinal story ever again. Agreed. Now we have pods, right? That's exactly right. Exactly. I don't want to hear you can't make it happen in Philly, because it happens in Philly now. All yes. He is crazy busy, right? Like, yes, we are. We are uh, we're shipping bathrooms to Palm Springs. We're shipping things great. down to Florida. Very, very excited with uh, what, the opportunities that we have. See, it only takes one girl to get That's fired. Exactly to start right. an empire. That's right. Right. Well, <laughs> the inspiration that she created, I was able to kind of step in and uh, soften it just a hair. Right, right. What, I'm not soft? That, well, you know... <laughs> You, you told in them Philly, I'm not soft. Let's just point that yeah, out. Well, Philly, they couldn't handle how strong you were with what, how, how out of date they were. I'm with saying, how they were doing no things. more of that stuff. Hold on a second. Watch this. Come here, you. I was going to say, yeah. Get over here. <laughs> this is my little brother. My real little yeah, brother, Devin Kalka. Good to the see you again. Group, doing yes. some amazing, 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 not because he's my brother, amazing things on Long Island. Tell us what you're here for. Why did you come well, besides me? I love his hat. He's going to hire us to yes, do that. Yes, he is. He is. There he yes. is. <laughs> yeah. Wait, real <laughs> business happens it's at Advancing happened. Prefab. That's Absolutely. how it works. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right, I'll let you go. Thank you. Thank All right, you. this is my real little brother. He's a godfather of my daughter. True story. And uh, tell is it a good show? Be honest, even though it's me. It's amazing. It really is. You've blown my mind, and I think everyone else's mind here, but the so many possibilities, right? And it's very new for me, but right. I'm, my mind's just like, what am I going to do next, right? Where do I start? Let's hit it one at a time, but it, it's exciting. Good. If only you knew an expert in prefab that could help you. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Love you. Nice. All right. How come you don't have red shoes on? Yeah, how come you're not wearing red shoes? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I want to go here. We're gonna come. Here. We're doing a live show right now. Let's get you guys on from Falk Belt. Do you yeah, guys know Falk Belt? They do amazing stuff. Why don't we get their stuff in the background? Yeah, I'll come over here. Stuff. Can you guys all spin that way? Hey, my God, my friends at Stowe. Can, can I come you in here between you guys? Yeah, well. you're welcome to come We're gonna in. do a little bit of a double. Tell them about Falk Belt. Absolutely. So this is our Falk Belt solution. We do what we call digital component construction. Yeah. Um, so everything is digitally made in our factory in Calgary. Um, everything you see here, we have produced and made. So I can show you the inside of the wall as well. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So the whole structure is bulk built. These guys are tech enabled. This Go is ahead. no joke. These guys have it together. So you see all of our, um, the cladding. Right. Let me go in here and just take a quick look. Yeah. yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll get some uh, B-roll footage on that. I want to be able to hear you guys. Dave Cooper live show with Amy Marks takeover at Advancing Prefab. I had to get a pop in there. I might be out of a job if this keeps up. <laughs> hey, thanks. Nice to meet you, Lauren. Come say hi to Victoria. Tell hey, Victoria. Tell Victoria who you are and that you're at the show. I love getting diverse population at the show. We need, by the way, more women speakers next year. You're going to get You're right. We do need more women speakers. All right. Tell us what you do. Uh, Victoria Callen, we're for performance contracting. Spent the last 20 years in the Bay Area doing our design build group, building hospitals, clean rooms, high-tech biotech. Do prefab there. Uh, we have our Portland group who does pods and prefab, and I just started our Denver office with PCI. We're so also going to be doing prefab. Wow. If you need stuff in Denver, call my friend. Awesome. Yeah. We do real business here at Advanced Prefab. And you guys are growing. That's what I just heard. We love right? that. Okay, business wait. is good. Let's, let's go over to Stowe. Where are my friends right. from Stowe? Come on over and go to your thing. Hey, and don't worry, everybody. I, I am here. We'll get back to our interview with Jamie Johnson in a little bit here. We, we were That's what we were doing. This is the Dave Cooper Live Takeover <laughs> Show. There's no Dave. He's holding the camera. So we've got, um, by the way, A lot Stowe, less stress back here. <laughs> Stowe is doing amazing things. They have amazing affiliates here. I was blown away by your branch technology stuff next door to them. They have amazing robotic stuff going on with the Stowe Partnership. Absolutely. Tell us about Stowe. I'll get on camera so you don't okay, look so, so like, you know. Yeah. No, so Stowe is an international company. We we introduced Stowe panel technology to the market in the U.S. about 11 years ago, and it's growing 
with tremendous success, teamed up with phenomenal partners around the country. Andrew with Renner, our, one of my friends. Andrew Renner, one yeah. of the best in the business, right? Center line, right? right? Center line prefab out of Grand them. Rapids, great. Right group of affiliates and then our partners. Here, let's walk over So here. it's all exterior and cladding and oh, panels, yep. right? Exterior okay. Walls. Just so everybody knows. That looks like a foam product almost. Windows, wind yeah. windows into the walls. Wow, panel. cool. Well, light so they can carry. Light. Here, yeah, yeah. watch this. This is the coolest thing. This is some cool stuff. Watch this. Check this out. I have to come back over. This is Kevin from Branch Technology. Check this. Nice to meet you, Kevin. Nice to meet you. Tell us about your product. And they have a partnership. Oh, wow, look at this. Also, check this out. Look at what's going on over here. So we have a, a freeform 3D printed matrix uh, using a using a polymer carbon fiber base basis to uh, create this uh, 3D grid. How cool is that? Wait. Yeah. Then it's infilled. It's infilled. Two pound post cell polyurethane. Can you turn that sideways so we can yep. look at that? See, isn't okay. that cool? Look, this is inside of that. Yeah, yeah. So, and they can get any shape you want. So the grid gives you maybe. 70% of the shape of the final surface articulation Okay. The foam process, foaming it, and then uh, milling it down will give you, get you to about 90-95% yeah. of the surface finish. And then the final finish is applied over that to get you know, the rest of the way there, whether it's a stucco finish, it's whether so it's a cool. or finish. Wow, amazing. Plus, that is amazing. Jenny Han, get over here while you're here. This is Dave Cooper, the Dave Cooper Live Takeover Hi, show. Jenny. How are you? So they don't even know they're going to get on camera. Welcome to the Andy Some Mark of my show. friends, get over here, Klaus. The smart people from Bolt. You always want to work with nice people. Bolt, the Bolt company, it doesn't get any nicer and smarter. So these guys, rule, don't work what do you guys do at Bolt? Yeah, exactly. What, what do you do? What do you guys do at Bolt? Some design integration, supporting modular. Great. Right. industrialized construction yeah. yeah. These guys are right. super smart. They're both talking at the show, right? You talked to the show. How's we're it? done. We're you're all finished? Oh, we're we're like, you're relax. done. So yeah. this is Dave Cooper. This is the Dave Cooper Live Takeover Show. But Dave nice Cooper's holding guys. the camera. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Taking over Dave's I'm taking show. over Dave's show. Yeah, yeah. Nice meeting you. All right, Dave. Over world. Let's get back over. Hey, I'm going to try to get around. All right. All right. Let's see. Hey. Hi, friends from Inspire. Hey, guys. Wave. Oh, all right, here we go. Wave it up. Hey, guys. Awesome. Here we go. Hey, guys. Hey. My friends over at Binsky, these guys are doing amazing productization. Um, they have fantastic stuff, Inventor to Revit, configurator stuff we're building for them. It's amazing. So check out what they're doing at Binsky. Hey. You don't get to get away from What's up? What's up? Hiding, hiding in the background. I love that. I, honestly, these guys, I, I love that we get all the intelligentsia from like this industry and ecosystem, right? You're gonna, you're me? I'm but... seeing all the... <laughs> <laughs> me? Yeah. The construction dorks been on that show. All the smart guys come out and all the smart ladies. So this is the... We're doing Dave Cooper Live. So come on over. Hey, where am I going? Right, right here? There. How you doing? Oh, my friends from Construction Specialties. How are you? How are you doing? We had a great time talking last night. These guys are unbelievable. Tell us what you guys do. They have amazing products, and we want to do more of them. I would love to see you be wildly even more successful than you are. Tell us what you have to talk loud. Uh, what do we do? So we're doing modular stairs, balconies, awnings, prefabricated structures for structural steel, uh, pedestrian bridges. All kinds of miscellaneous steel and structural steel components wow. in a fully prefabricated, pre-designed process. Stop drawing stairs, architects. I keep saying stop drawing stairs, right? Absolutely. You can just buy stairs. They're products already. Don't worry. Oh, yeah. Stop wasting your time. Go do something more exciting than drawing stairs. Absolutely. Let me come over here. This is the Dave Cooper live show, but I'm not Dave Cooper. Yeah, that would be me. But I'm geez. Jamie Marks. I keep trying to pull in my better looking half into this, Jamie Johnson. I'm going to make him get with a, on stage. With a fabulous accent. I know. He has a, if I let him talk. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, if you if you let him talk, you you're, you're gonna lose the show. I you better just. <laughs> I know. Here we go. All right, these are my buddies over. I still don't have my body by Vin T-shirt. Yes, by the way. Got you, you do. Wait, let me hold it up. Hold on. I need, oh, I need one of those. Wait, tell me this is not the coolest T-shirt. Yeah, ever. I'm coming back for a medium. Woo. I love it. Oh, that is so body funny. Body by Vin. Is that by the way? Hey, that's my shape the, too. That's the, about this what. This is the body that Vin gets you with the Valve MVP. Body so, by Vin. By the way, these guys are fantastic. Tell them what you do because I love. This is one of our greatest partners. Tell us what you guys do. Yep, and speak up. Talk super loud like you're shouting. Got it. So we do a Revit plugin specifically for the mechanical, electrical sub trades, piping and plumbing as well. And we've also got a lot of things coming down the pipes from a materials procurement standpoint and cloud-based application. So stay tuned and keep watching us. 6.0 is coming out in a couple of months. 6.0. By the way, I am not a small, my friends. So, like, <laughs> you come back to me. When you, you're, you're I think about, for the body I, by I right love now. the fact that you think that's true. But I'll take a large when you're ready. And we got I, some MEP guys here. It's a big yeah. deal. 
These People are looking are awesome. for you. They are all looking for above anything. Yeah. All right, let's come on over here. Oh, no, our, our biggest. Oh, uh, so oh, yeah. I, I, I missed the Amway speech. Oh, no, great way to build your income, let me tell you. And just so you guys know, I was the model for those T-shirts. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it worked out real good for me. It's a very good, I bet it's good. Wait, let me put your hat on. Okay, you you're the only smart guy that makes me put their stuff on. Here we go. There you go. I'm not going to wear my underwear, so there you go. What else you got? Not on camera, obviously. Like, oh, I got a Dave it. Cooper live hat back there. That's a good idea. So they have been sponsoring. How many years have you sponsored the show now? Uh, three. They are amazing. What are you getting? Tell me why you keep coming back. Why is it so good? Well, it was the hug initially, but then for us, it's the business development. I'll take it's it. Awareness, right? And you guys get so much work out of this, right? We like, try to, yeah. I'm yeah. saying, you know, like, you keep talking, but we can't talk, and you're talking, so it's pretty tough for us. But you know, <laughs> we get it done. Amy we doesn't talk. Done. What no, do you mean? Not at all. She's paid. Ja right? Jamie's been in the show the whole time, right next to me here. <laughs> just Jamie over there. I, I just tell he's like, what are the world renowned Arctic? I'm like, just go look pretty over there in the corner. Well, and he's like, got the <laughs> accent. I'm kind of not doing a good job. That's what I. <laughs> this is Canadian, though, eh? This got the hockey players, all yeah, that yeah. Snow stuff, beer, exactly. We got it. We got so it. check out these guys; they have amazing stuff. I'm gonna steal this hat, you know that, right? Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, good. I just wanna yeah. let you know. So uh, good. Great we're show gonna, for us. We have to go that way, actually. Right, I think. Yeah, well. we're gonna. Yeah, go you did a great. Way. You did a great keynote, though. Here, very well. And then we'll go. Yeah. We're gonna walk around. We're wrapping up. I'm gonna walk back to the stage. Wave, my friends at Unsweet. Love you guys. Oh, we all know the guys down here. My tech, amazing. These guys, all these guys. We have Stratus down there. Yeah. USG, everyone's here. My buddies at Framecad. Say hi to Mark Taylor. All right, me. so there's a there's a there's yeah, a live. Oh, yeah, Amy, has a, we'll Amy has a live uh, coffee talk Q&A session coming up. We're going to go back, and I think while she's setting up, maybe Jamie and I can get a word in for a Yes, change. you should talk a lot to Jamie because he's super smart. We love Jamie. And while we're getting set up, and then I'm going to steal him back so I don't have to be alone yep. on stage. And I guess what? If you guys stick with us, uh, I'm going to try and capture some of Amy's Q&A and see if we can pull that in. Maybe not all of it, but we'll try. Make sure you watch the Dave Cooper live show. This time we took it over, but he's always awesome. So make sure you keep checking him out. All right, thanks, Amy. Let's go over here and, uh, hey, look. Hey, Jamie, welcome to the show. Still here. Still, still here. here, still here. <laughs> um, tell you what, we're just going to... We're just going to set this. You know, why don't we just go back over here, because then I can kind of control what we have going on. I can hear myself talking here. So let me turn this down, and uh, we know we're actually going live. So don't look at that, or it'll confuse the daylights out of you. Jamie Johnson, Brian Woods, you had a great, you had a great presentation and keynote yesterday as well. I love how you were showing the high-rise steel automated process. Right, how you were just lifting those up with very little labor yeah, yeah, on site yeah, yeah. to do it. Why don't you tell us uh, a little bit about what you were talking about in there? Uh, so for the past, past five years, uh, we've tr been trying to crystallize everything that we've learned about DFMA right. into a, a kind of small, repeatable kit of parts. So it's like IKEA for construction. Uh, so the idea was just like everyone can build a wardrobe if you had a small enough kit of parts, right. simple enough tasks, anyone can build a building. Uh, so that's how we're going to start to address skills gap and the aging demographic and things. But uh, we then got to the point again, well, if you had simple, repeatable tasks, you could automate those. Yeah. And so one of the ways we're going to uh, increase the bandwidth of our existing right, people right. is a bit of automation and start okay. to dramatically change the way we build right. buildings. But, um, Let me put this down so we can set this up. And I want to talk a little bit more uh, in regards to just your background, too, so people truly know who you are. And, and, you know, how did you get into this space doing what you're doing? Uh, so I always wanted to be an architect. I think yeah. I was always obsessed with cities and like walking around and going, like, someone made this, how do they make it? How right. do I learn how to do that? So I think from a young age, I wanted to be an architect. Right, right. Okay. Uh, when and I was at college, I met Martin Wood and Mark Bryden, the Bryden and oh, yeah. Bryden Woods. Uh, sure. Really liked the stuff they were doing in the arts. Hey, so, 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 so I was employed at Mark Bryden Wood and I've been there ever since. So. Okay. Right, right. Now. And we always had this interest in how do you get the benefits of manufacturing into construction? Yeah. How do we start to transfer the construction? Sure, sure. So they're going to see a little bit more of us because in June you and I are speaking, and I'm coming over to your neck of the yes, your yeah, yeah, side yeah, yeah, of the pond. Yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, so we'll be doing some speaking there, and 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 you want to come uh, and see the projects I showed yesterday as well? We, we should. Site. You want to do yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, should we should go on site, site and live stream from the project. Why don't we yes. show people live? Yeah, yeah, we'll do a show from there. Looks amazing. Looks absolutely fantastic. I think we're. Definitely going to do that. Uh, Amy's getting ready to do her Q&A, so we're going to go over there and try and bring some of that to you. all of you out there until I maybe die on batteries at this point. <laughs> 
you know, but we're going to try and bring you as much as we can. Overall, uh, what's, what's your thought on the show so far? Uh, it's amazing, actually. So it's the first time that I've been to this show, but the scale of it is incredible. To yeah. see this many people talking in, in, in this way, but also I think the, the sophistication of the language and thinking, yeah. it's incredible, actually. There's, there's some amazing stuff that I didn't know was happening. So, uh, yeah, no, it's, it's definitely, yeah. definitely you know, a focal point for this type of work. The education that's happening here in the workshops, right? It's not just people talking. I mean, there's actual workshops where they're teaching how to do things, and I think that's super, super important that we don't see, you know, a whole lot of other trade shows. Yeah, that's. I think certainly the UK, a lot of these things, people are sort of showing a you know, polished presentation. Right. I like the fact here people are showing all the mistakes they made, what actually happened, right. what went wrong, the challenges they faced, exactly. so people are much more. Uh, sharing of their journey to help other people come on the journey rather yeah. than sort of if they've got anywhere going right that's right. my thing to protect now so that I think is incredible it's how we're, we're all going to move forward in this space it, it is and you know yeah, you guys have a little bit of a leg up on us though with some of the MMC rules that have been put in place uh, compared to what we have going on here I heard you're coming here though yes. Biden Woods is coming to the United States yep. are you going to bring some of that knowledge and hopefully some of that influence so we can build better here yeah definitely the, the plan is that it, all the stuff that in the UK isn't really UK specific. Right. Okay. It could be deployed anywhere. So the thinking was always if we have some ideas that could be propagated, yep. the more widely we send them out into the world, sure. you know, the more if we can accelerate everyone's journey, then that's just good for the industry, it's good for the planet. Yeah, just in general. Yeah. Yeah. How, how, is the, how is the adoption of more modern methods of building or industrialized construction been for uh, you and your team? And what are you seeing in England that we're not seeing here? Uh, it's been hard work, but it's, we used to say it's like being HD ready in the 80s, where right. we've been poised, but yeah. no one was broadcasting or receiving, right, right. so yeah, last few years it's definitely ramped up. I think the big difference is in the UK, there's a sort of very central government focus on this and things like construction innovation, hardly met truly, so right, right. there's a sort of central focus on it. Here there's nothing like that, there's not the kind of federal input, but yeah. we're seeing the big serial clients and the big GCs wanting to do it, wanting to get a better value proposition. So there's, right, there's right. different drivers, but the same uh, problems of productivity, sure, carbon sure, and all sure. these things. So are, you, are, you seeing, are, you, are you feeling the labor crunch still there as we're feeling it here, or are you finding that that may be changing a little bit as the methods of construction change? No, it's still a massive problem. And certainly yeah. Brexit, we've had a lot of uh, our labor forces left the country, so that's been a real problem. And We've got the same demographic problem that you've got right, here. Right. We're about to lose a lot of our workforce in the next 10 to 15 years. So, sure. Hence our interest in automation and things, because if we can't massively increase productivity, right, then right. we can't possibly build enough stuff. There's hundreds of millions of pounds worth of stuff in the UK, trillions probably in the, in the, in the globally. Right, right. That's a problem that we need to collectively yeah. start addressing. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Well, listen, uh, we're going to head over here in just a second. Jamie, uh, what's the easiest way for people to find find you? They want to do business with Brian Woods. What do they got to do? Uh, Brianwood.com yeah. is the best place. There's loads of resources there. There's all the apps, there's videos, there's documents. There's, there's tons of resources yeah. that you can look at. And then uh, hopefully that gets some interest. You can see what we're doing. If any of that's of use, then uh, right. yeah, reach out. We'd love to, love sure. to find more people to partner with here, particularly yeah. in the US as we move into, into yeah. Boston. And we're speaking uh, June 23rd uh, in England. But as you guys heard it, we're, we're looking to go on one of their job sites that uh, Brian Wood has done. Wait until you see the technology that, that you have come up with to actually simplify some of the construction process with, you know, heavy steel construction. I think it's absolutely amazing. It you can do amazing. a lot less, you know, you can do a lot more with less. Yes, absolutely. Because yeah. of the systems that you have come up with. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, so, that's the whole plan is how do we how do we do more with less? How do we get better? Hello, right. 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 Uh, right. There's Amy again. Oh, there go, <laughs> awesome, awesome.